uh what's up guys so today i decided to film another sketchbook tour since i am home for the weekend and all of my sketchbooks are here so i thought i would just record them um to preface i am missing a sketchbook that is in between the one that i showed in my last video and this one i can't find it anywhere i looked a lot so hopefully i'll be able to find that soon i don't know um but we're just gonna start with this one this one was like my sophomore year in high school yeah i made all of these stickers um these ones are all handmade these are two ocs this is muffet from undertale and then game grumps and then my dad got these made for me from like sticker app i think um don't know what that is i'm just gonna flip through the pages that are don't have anything substantial on them I was really into Game Grumps during this sketchbook era. <laughs> this was really inspired by Leilani Joy's Ophelia piece. I was gonna do like something for school. It never worked out. Also, this is when I discovered sticky notes for covering up bad stuff. So be prepared for a lot of that. Yeah. <laughs> this was for my story. It was gonna be like a little robot beetle that like plants seeds, like poops them out. <sighs> These are rough. <laughs> this was from the book Young Elites. I really don't know what's happening. This shading does not make sense at all, but. <laughs> mm, I think that was supposed to be Wednesday. More Muffet. I was also really into Undertale right about now, so. This is from Mad Father. I still low key want to do like a piece about Mad Father. That was one of the first, like, what are those called? I don't know what those are called, but that was one of the first ones I saw Markiplier play. <laughs> And I was like, those are so cool. Some mushrooms. Um, I got, this is when I got my Pintle Pocket Brush Pen. And my friends were like, oh. I drew this one, my other friend drew this one, and then a different person wrote this. Honey Lemon. More Undertale. Mermaid. More Undertale. This is my OC Ace. This is one of the... I really liked this one when I drew it. I was like, he's so cute. This shirt doesn't even have a collar on it. This is Alfie. I don't even draw my OCs anymore, so... More Alfie. He used to be like just a human, then I turned him into a goat boy. And then I turned it back into human, and I I don't know, it was just a mess. This was supposed to be like a love interest. Interest, like she was obsessed with one of the boys, but they didn't like her, I think. Mmm, sticky. <laughs> um, Mavis and Alfie, my OCs. I was like, oh my gosh, cute. This is a gender bend of Ace. Um, so this is just like a flame girl that I saw on Pinterest. And then I drew it on a cover of an old notebook that I have. Let me go check and see if I still have it. So this is the notebook. I drew a little booty crack. And my mom was like, oh, what the? And I was like, what? Looked really scandy, so I covered up with a sticker because I was embarrassed. Um, 
Let's look through this one real quick while we're here. It only has like five drawings in it. Um, I was practicing profiles. I actually got this sketchbook at Ikea. And the paper's not that great. And then I was gonna do, I bought a couple, and so I was gonna do a water version. Um, some Life is Strange stuff. I actually watched someone play the game again. It's so bad. <laughs> That's it for that one, so. And then more Flame Girl. I actually really like the like candle wax dress thing. I think that's cute. A demon. I was really into drawing demons. I used to draw them on like little like trading card size, but I've lost all of them. I can't find them anywhere. Oh, this is a redraw. I don't know why I covered this up. I didn't even draw a face. Oh, we're about to get into some Valentines. And so this is a Valentine's of my OC Ace because he owns like a candy store. Um, this is an undertone one. You can't really see it. That's better. But this was a uh, Ocarina of Time slash I don't know, like a Legend of Zelda slash Game Grumps reference thing. It's got the Majora's Mask moving in it, so I don't. I really don't know. Um. Another, this was a Animal Crossing mixed with a ninja sex party reference. So it's like, you're like a fossil sample and I'm an impatient, impatient paleontologist because I want to date you badly. <laughs> so, there's a narwhal girl mermaid thing. Uh, Oxalotl girl that I drew without a reference, so I don't know how accurate. You, I'm just taking off all of these sticky notes. <laughs> this Blue Raven from Teen Titans. Um, we're not opening that. This was gonna be Melanie Martinez. Ooh, yeah. Another Narwhal girl. Practicing my signature. This is when my Instagram account was Doodle with Jada. Pines. A uh, page, but like the human version of her. I remember drawing this and some kid like looked at me and they were like, okay, and I was like, what? Because I was all angsty. Uh, my OC Clove, but it was like an underwater girl. Look how tiny those hands are. Itty bitty. Like her head. Her wow. Um, go go from Big Hero 6. Uh, this was from the Night Circus, I think her name was like Cecilia. I didn't actually ever finish reading it, but I read the first part and so I drew that. Uh, this is Octopus Girl in the Bathtub. This is when I really wasn't into like filling sketchbooks, and then I would watch like a sketchbook video. I'm trying to do a page like, like trying to finish it like this, but yeah. So just, this is a life drawing actually of a pine cone in my bio, my biology class. So. There's nothing on here, okay. I think it was covering this probably. Henry Puffer from The Sims. <laughs> Getting just some concept ideas. I think this is Fran Bow. My OC Mavis. I think I drew this on a piece of paper and then I tried to copy it into here. Daybok from Return to Superman or Xi'an, I should say, because he's old now, so he doesn't use his infant nickname. Um, what is number three? I think that's number three. This is a like an I'm sorry card to my mom because I was being a brat hole. These are some pen sketches. Uh, I drew Ace and Mavis as Princess Prince Gumball and Marceline. 
Um, I was trying to teach my friend how to draw a face and stars. I used to really like this one. I was like, oh my gosh, it's so cute. Same thing of teaching someone how to draw a face. Um, this one I thought was really cute when I drew it. And then this tag means like bay monies because he's bay. You know what I mean? Um, this is for an art trade collab thing. Same thing. The other girl she drew Dipper and I drew Mabel. Dipper. Sorry. Navi. Another blank sticker. Some more aces. This is when I started getting into drawing their like human forms. Um. There's so many concepts. I have 400 followers on Instagram. Big deal, big deal. This is Nikki Name Palm. I drew her for an art assignment, but I cut it up because I didn't like it. This is for my brother's birthday. <laughs> um, some demons. And um, Yugum, um, Bam Bam, and Boom. I really like this Yu-Gi-Oh one. I drew a, I did a Copic marker version of it. I don't know where that is. I wish I did. It's, it was so cute. Um, Yugi, Sana, and then this was supposed to be Genesee from Top Dog. Oh, Astro, BTO. Uh, this was gonna be Biju from Top Dog, but I never finished it. I miss Top Dog. <laughs> Uh, this was an old OC. I don't, I think she's like called the marionette or something. I never had a name. Um, this is Mr. Din. He's like a little bean man. And he's like my favorite. More of her. I gave her away, but I don't even think the person uses her, so. Um, more concepts. This is supposed to be Young One from Monsta X. My dog just barked. And then some sketches. My friend, he really likes this one to this day. And I'm like, okay. Uh, uh, these were Mint Peanuts characters that like run a pet store. And she likes cats and he likes dogs or something like that. Uh, more Ace. Mavis. And this was like, I saw a tag that's like, draw your OC and what you're wearing right now. And I was wearing a dress. I look like this and she doesn't wear dresses that often so and an aerial thing that I had to do for a um, contest and this is my sister's OC Melvin he's like a emo wizard or something and that's it for this one yeah thanks for watching another sketchbook tour hopefully I'll be able to finish them all get all of my old ones out and then I can update you on my newer ones that actually look nice or that actually like make sense but thanks for watching like subscribe all that junk sick <laughs> <laughs>